Team investigation into the number of Kia vehicles burning up here in the Bay Area and across the country now catching the attention of a U.S. Senator. I-Team reporter Jackie Callaway met with the congressman who's now calling for an investigation. But my car is on fire. The I-Team uncovered more than 60 reports of fires in Kia Sorentos and Optimas since 2011. Oh we've, my goodness. We've got six other people. Senator Nelson caught one of our first reports in April. Then last month, get over, get over. The ranking member of the Commerce Committee, which oversees the auto industry, watched the footage of another Kia going up in flames on I-4. The minute I saw that, I said, we got to get to the bottom of this. Senator Nelson now asking the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration what steps it's taking to address the fires. We followed up with NHTSA, and a spokesperson told us in this email the agency is reviewing the issue and will take appropriate action to protect the American public. Is that their car? It is. I saw flames and smoke coming out of the front of the car. Just last week, Dwayne Silva and his 10-year-old son were in their 2014 Kia Forte when the engine erupted into flames. Me and my son just jumped out of the car, ran down the side of the freeway, and we look back and the car is just engulfed in flames. Dwayne, who lives in California, is the sixth Kia owner we've interviewed who claims the manufacturer has no interest in examining the car for a cause. A statement of what happened and no other further actions from that. The Center for Auto Safety last week also formally requested NHTSA investigate what it calls an alarming number of fires. There ought to be an immediate recall. It's an urgent matter. Jackie Calloway taking action for you.